Uh, today we're going to talk about muscular versus elastic arteries. It's going to be quick since it's very simple. Basically, it's all about the elastic laminae. Okay, these lasagna noodles that you might find in your slide. Now, we borrow the term lamina from Latin. It means plate or layer. So you're basically looking for a layer of elastic fibers. And in muscular arteries, you'll find two of these layers that you can kind of use to define the boundaries of the tunica media. Okay, so here you see an internal elastic lamina here closer to the lumen. And you see an external elastic lamina a little bit closer to the tunica adventitia. Okay, this one is a little bit harder to spot. But if you zoom in, you'll see it. Now, again, you can use these to define the boundaries of the tunica media. The internal elastic lamina is in between the intima and the media. The external elastic lamina is in between the media and the adventitia. They might not jump out at you right away, but if you only see elastic fibers here and here and nowhere else, it's a muscular artery. Okay, now muscular arteries worry more about being able to constrict and dilate than to stretch and snap. Right? So they don't really need a lot of elastin, but they do need a lot of smooth muscle. And you'll see that reflected in the structure. The tunica media will be very prominent um, in smooth muscle cells with very little to no elastic fibers except for the two elastic laminae. Now the arteries that do have to stretch and snap, the largest arteries that are closer to your very strong heart, <laughs> those are going to be rich in elastic fibers, okay? And you'll see it doused in them right away. Now, elastic fibers allow arteries to be able to withstand quick changes in pressure, right, during systole and diastole. So if you see what looks like a lot of lasagna noodles, a lot of elastic fibers, you're looking at an elastic artery, okay? It'll be pretty unmistakable. And that's really all there is to it. If it's not doused in elastic fibers, and you only see the two elastic laminae, it's a muscular artery. So I hope that helps.